I can see it now. Two of you sitting in front of the TV night after night after night, just like they did. You could sit there for hours and hours and never say a word. And everywhere you go in the house, she'll be there doing things, making noises, complaining, dragging you into her life. You can do the same thing to her, ruining her vitality and dreams with your failures and mistakes. But sooner or later, you'll cheat on her. What's worse than that, not only will you cheat on her, but you'll resent her for it. You'll have your affair in the middle of the afternoon and come home and she'll be there doing the things that she does as if nothing happened. And you'll think to yourself, how goddamn stupid can she be not to see it? And worse than that, the hard part is that you love her. You truly love everything about her and it's killing you. The duplicity, the insecurities, the silences. Years later, you wonder who she's thinking about when she gets that far away look in her eyes. Maybe she's having an affair. Some low life like you has come along at the right time with romance and lies, just like the ones that you use. And has got her attention. He's got her lowly, drifting body and soul for a few hours every two weeks. And then she comes home, and I'll be there doing the things, whatever I do. And she'll think to herself, how oh, goddamn stupid can he be not to see what I'm doing? And in the end, marriage won't be about caring. It'll be about enduring, seeing who outlives who. Standing there at the grave when it's all over, crying your eyes out because only then Realize how much you love them, how much you need them, how much you want them. You never saw it. <laughs> Me? I'm never getting married, never. I fear it worse than death. <laughs>